Location may require put away warehouse receipt or both when dealing with purchase processes. This update enables use of warehouse processes for project-related purchases. It allows you to create purchase orders for locations where directed put away and pick is enabled. For other locations, it allows you to use standard standardized processes when dealing with purchase orders. Let's see the demo. Let's open project planning lines. We use the same item in all lines, but locations are different as we want to explore impact of various warehouse settings. The silver location requires put away. The yellow location only requires a warehouse receipt. The white location has the directed put away and pick setting enabled, means this location requires both receipt and put away steps. The main location doesn't require any special warehouse handling of inbound transactions. First, we create purchase order for required items using the new functionality added in the previous release. We will create one purchase order covering all needed items. Next, we generate an inventory put away for the silver location. Now open and post the created document to receive item. We then create warehouse receipts. One for the yellow location, receipt only. One for the white location, directed put away and pick. When purchase order is linked to project, the put away step will be skipped since items are consumed immediately. Finally, we receive the item at the main location directly from the purchase order. We also post the invoice. Purchase order is completely posted. So we are returning to project planning lines where you can see that quantity and cost is already registered. Thank you for watching. You can find more information about capability in the release note. You can find the link in the description.